IRECO's boxcar webbing securement system provides a safer, cost-effective alternative to steel banding. The webbing securement system consists of two components. The first is a length of webbing with a hook assembly attached to one end. This part is typically installed on the closed door side of the boxcar. The second component is a length of webbing with a hook assembly attached to one end and a ratchet assembly attached to the other end. This part is typically installed on the open door side of the boxcar. The webbing securement system has more than twice the strength of one and a quarter inch steel banding and there are no dangerous sharp edges or tension that is associated with steel banding. It reduces loading and unloading time, requires no special tools, and the need for dunnage material is reduced or eliminated. The hook assemblies can be installed in the IRECO smooth side or dog bone lading tie anchors. IRECO lading tie anchors are the standard in the overwhelming majority of boxcars, so there is typically no retrofit required. To install the hook assembly, position the hook near the anchor with the webbing end of the assembly pointing towards the doorway of the boxcar. Next, Strike the hook with a glancing blow with the palm of your hand. This will lock the hook into the wall anchor. To maintain the correct height of the webbing and to keep it out of the way during loading of the car, install the webbing supports into the doorpost anchor. Install the webbing supports at approximately the same height as the lading tie anchors to which the hooks are attached and insert the webbing into the slot in the webbing support. Allow the balance of the webbing to hang freely. Install the hook and ratchet assemblies and webbing supports in a similar manner to the open door side of the boxcar. The quantity and location of webbing assemblies will vary depending on the particular load configuration. In any case, the angle between the sidewall and the webbing should not exceed 12 degrees to prevent pulling in of the boxcar walls. Allow the ratchets to hang outside of the boxcar door so that they are out of the way during loading. Continue to load the commodity into the ends of the car. When loading is complete, enclose the webbing around the cargo. If necessary, insert suitable dunnage between the commodity and the ratchet to prevent damage to the commodity. Adjust the webbing on the ratchets so that the ratchets are approximately in the lateral center of the load. Insert the free end of the webbing into the slot in the ratchet mandrel and pull the free end back up and over the mandrel and toward the side wall. Ratchet the handle to take up the excess slack and tighten the load. When all the ratchets have been installed, the extension bar can be used for additional leverage. When tightening is complete, ensure that all ratchets are in the fully locked position. When both ends of the car are loaded and secured, continue to load the doorway of the car, making sure to protect the lading from the ratchets with suitable dunnage. The doors can then be closed and the car can be shipped to its destination. When the car arrives at the destination, first unload the doorway. To release the ratchets, move the handle to the unlocked position and loosen and remove the free end of the webbing. If not already in position, install the webbing supports into the doorpost anchor at the appropriate heights and insert the webbing into the supports to keep it out of the way during unloading. Allow the ratchets to hang outside of the doorway. Next, unload the commodity from the ends of the car. To remove the webbing assemblies from the anchors, pull the webbing slightly towards the end of the car and strike the hook assembly with your palm. The IRECO webbing securement system is reusable and it can be shipped back to your loading facility.